everybody, welcome back to Southeast by Midwest. I'm Cassie and as you know this week is all about the Pixie Pretty sets. And today's video is all about the Wiley collaboration which is the Dimensional Eye Creator Kit. So if you want to know more about this and my thoughts on it, just keep watching. As always here on Southeast by Midwest, before we get to talking about the products, we always do the disclosure, and I do apologize for the air conditioning, but it is roasting hot in here because it is South Carolina and it is over 80 degrees. So we're just going to deal with the window unit and I do apologize. But the disclosure for this video and corresponding blog post is that this was sent to me for consideration for a review. However, as always, and if you saw um, the Chloe video, you know my opinions are always 100% honest and always my own. Speaking of which, the Chloe uh, review will be linked down below if you want to check out my thoughts on that part of the collaboration. As I said in the Chloe uh, video, the Pixie collaboration this year was again with three people. The first one was Chloe Morello, the second one is Wiley, and the third one is Dulce Candy. As I also mentioned in the Chloe one, I had heard of Chloe Morello, I had followed Dulce Candy, I had never heard of Wiley. So this, getting this actually introduced me to a new YouTuber, which is one of the reasons why I like this Pixie Pretties collaboration. Um, the same thing happened last year. There were, I think there was one that I knew of and the other ones were new to me and I actually still follow several of them. As I mentioned again in the Chloe video, Chloe's video, uh, collaboration was a two parts and they were purchased separately. Wiley's is also two parts, but they come together in one kit. And OMG, am I glad they do because, honey, this kit is amazing. This is seriously my favorite part of the Pixie Pretty set. So let's start with the smaller part of this, and this is the Pixie and Wiley uh, dual ended liner. One end is a coal liner, one end is a felt tip liner. So we go boom, and we go boom. And we have a coal liner, which let me put the lid back on that part so I don't color all over myself. So this is the coal liner part. That was just a couple strokes over that. So let me do it again so you can see. See? Very inky. You can smudge it out. But once you give it time, it will set nice and stay. And it rolls back down. Which I enjoy. Have you ever gotten those eyeliners or those brow pencils where you roll it up and you didn't realize that you couldn't unroll it and you're just stuck there? I hate it when that happens. So when this rolled back down, I was like, yes, piss pop. The other end, as I said, is a felt liner. And I guess I'll go ahead and do this over here so you can see it. And it is nice and it's this top line here. Um, it is nice and wet. It is very black, really love it. Again, you can smudge it when you first get it, but if you let it dry, it stays. Really, really love this. As you all know, if you've been around, I'm not a big eyeliner fan, but this has made me an eyeliner fan. I am seriously tempted to repurchase this set just to get another one of these because I love this pen so freaking much. Love it. What I love even more though is the fact that the palette that comes in this set is amazing as well so if i do repurchase it i'm at least getting some a good palette as well not just you know up oh, up oh, toss that i actually see myself hitting pan on this it is that good again to go over we have the clear front that says pixie plus wiley on it the back is their signature green with the shade names on the back it opens on the side like not all of their palettes do but some do and then we have six shadows this is perfect if you're traveling or if you just want a small thing and unlike the Chloe one we have one two three matte shades and one two three shimmer shades so this is totally a palette that I could just fold up toss in my bag and go or I could just leave it on the vanity if I know I'm gonna need to get ready quick and in a hurry and I can create subtle looks I can create dramatic looks and it is one that you can go from day to night with as well if you just toss it in your purse and it's small enough that you can Seeing as how I'll be going to a four-year university in August, that is a couple of towns over, I will have to drive 
a good distance to get to school each day. So if Travis wants to go to dinner afterwards, because there are some places that have gluten-free options in that town, you know, I don't have time to come all the way back home, get ready, and then us go somewhere for dinner. So being able to take this with me to class and being able to run to the bathroom and change from my day to night look is amazing. So I love that. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to swatch these and I'll be right back. All right, so the first thing we're gonna talk about are the matte shades, which I believe are Sista, Potato, and Balm. Sista is like a camel brown, Potato is like a kind of mahogany, and then Balm is like a brick red, and I think Ghost just ran off with the lip icing from the Chloe Morello video. In other news, Ghost is on the floor, rolling around with the lip icing, so she loves it as well. Cassie tested, Ghost approved. Back to the Wiley set. So here are the swatches, this one being Sista, this one being uh, Potato, and this one being Bomb. I really like the shades. It is something that you could start with the Sister color, which is this lighter brown shade, and kind of build it up. You can then work in these deeper shades if you want to. Y'all, she done took the lip ice and clear across the room. She was right by this bed that I'm sitting on, but now she's all the way over at the door. Roll it all over the place with it. Get it, girl. All right, now for the shimmers, we have this kind of champagne shade, which is girl, with an exclamation point. We got this kind of rose gold shade here, which is itty bitty. I do not know why she came up with these names. I wonder if it's in the video that I didn't watch. And this darker shade here is a beautis, and it is beautimous because it's, it's gorgeous, y'all. That would be perfect for a deep, evening eye the rose gold would be perfect for a daytime eye so would the champagne but the champagne would also make a good kind of inner corner highlight kind of taking it up into like that first third if you wanted to use it and the rose gold together absolutely gorgeous i'm telling you love this palette love 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 it like i said could totally see hitting pan now i will say because you can totally see it this shade here which i'm assuming is itty bitty I don't know if it's backwards or not, but it's the uh, rose gold. It does have a little crumbling to it, and you probably will get a little fallout. Just either have something like a tissue underneath there when you use it, just in case, or do your um, foundation last, which is what I usually do, just in case. But in all honesty, the crumbling only got there after I dug my finger into it. If you actually just tap your brush in and then put it on, you don't have that problem, or at least I didn't. I also do want to mention that if you um, spritz these with a little like Fix Plus or the Pixie um, makeup fixing spray, it, they're even more gorgeous. But they're that is just straight out of the pan. That is not even with any Fix Plus or anything like that. And while I am showing you finger swatches these still performed amazing on the eye all right so my final thought slash review on the dimensional eye creator kit is that I love well I love and hate that these were put together I kind of hate it that she only got one little kit instead of two um, I hate that they come together because if I want to just repurchase one or the other I have to buy the whole set but I kind of love that because I totally think that I'm gonna wind up hitting pan but not everyone will so that's why I kind of love and hate it so I highly recommend purchasing this at least once though because you cannot go wrong with these shadows or this liner both are fantastic and I've got fingerprints all over this oh that's gonna be gorgeous for the blog nothing a little old Hendrickson makeup wipe can't fix Hopefully you found this video fun and informative. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up, share it with all your friends. It really does help. Leave me a comment down below telling me what you think of this Dimensional Eye Creator Kit. Make sure to follow me on all the social media links down below so you don't miss anything. Until next time, bye!